Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Supermom Legacy and thanks again for coming onto my channel. Um, if you're new to my channel, please um, follow me um, <laughs> for more videos. Um, you can probably see my son's um, feet and hands over there because I'm filming today um, with my son around. Um, but I have another hack um, to share with you guys again today and I hope that this will be really useful for you. Um, just to share, um, I live in um, a really tiny house um, in Singapore. I like to call my house a tiny house because I feel like there isn't really enough space for myself as well as my son. Um, I'll admit that you know I am a hoarder. Um, I am a hoarder of jujube bags. <laughs> Uh, how many of us are anyway, right? Um, and I am a hoarder of like clothes and uh, whatever it is that you know ladies love to hoard. Um, but at the same time, I am also a hoarder of um, kids' toys because I really absolutely love how my son is you know so happy whenever he receives like a new toy, you know, or he gets to kind of like just stay at home and play the whole day, you know, without uh, complaining about being bored. Um, so that's why. Um, I think, um, you know, my house is a pretty tiny house. Um, I live in a 920 um, <laughs> square feet house. Um, I know in Singapore, that's kind of like, you know, um, not too bad actually. <laughs> but, and, and I mean, you know, it's only like three of us at home. So it's me, my husband, um, as well as my son. Um, but of course, um, you know, there's always... Uh, there's always more that we want, right? So, yeah, I always, um, you know, tell people that um, in my tiny house, I need to keep things uh, minimalist as best as I can and really simple. So there are things that I try to, you know, um, improve on so that we can kind of like, you know, just keep discovering more spaces for ourselves um, at home. So one of the things that kind of really changed my life um, with this chair is that um, when my son was really young, um, you know, when he was like six months old and he could start, um, you know, sitting up on his own, um, we initially purchased um, uh, a really big um, wooden kind of like high chair, um, you know, which uh, took up, well, a fair bit amount of space. And I've... I, felt that I couldn't, I, I, how do I put it, I was really lost at like where I should keep, you know, like placing the chair because the chair wasn't exactly uh, very foldable. Uh, it was foldable to a certain extent, but I couldn't, you know, really keep it uh, without having that bulk, you know, like existing because it is a high wooden chair, you know. Um, so when I discovered this chair, um, I told myself, that you know, um, I would purchase this again if I ever had you know another child or a second kid, um, and this chair can actually be used, you know. Um... <laughs> Sorry, my son just had an accident um, when he threw his toys on the floor. But um, this chair can actually be used, at, uh, you know, from the start when um, the baby is only six months old, and my son is currently two and a half years old and he's still enjoying this chair he still has a lot of space on this chair so let me just give you you know a look um on this chair this chair is actually called um sorry i can't really remember what this is called um it's called agar um i think it's a korean brand if i'm not wrong um but basically it's so foldable i think um i forgot there was another brand that had a similar um design of chair but uh i tried the other brand i I'm, I'm really sorry i forgot what that brand was i tried the other brand but the way the chair folds up for this particular brand which is agard is extremely smooth and the closure is extremely easy as compared to the other brand uh, if you remember what that brand is, you may leave that comment uh, down in, um, in the comment boxes. Uh, <laughs> yeah, but um, I'm not, you know, dissing any brands, but it's just that I have a preference for this particular brand called Agard. And look at how slim this chair folds up to. Look at how slim it is. You know, it doesn't take up much much space. Um, and I can just, you know, leave it in a corner of my room. And nobody actually even remembers the chair. And for a really small house like this, you know, this chair works amazing for us. 
Okay, so um, yeah, I'm just gonna show you how this chair opens up. So um, and, and by the way, um, at the bottom, there are these you know like rubber um stoppers. Um, so if you are afraid that you know um. You know your child is gonna tip over from the chair because the chair is too light which i know a lot of people have um you know reservations uh, with a lot of high chairs because they are too light and there are problems of tipping over this chair is not gonna tip over because it has a really large base when it's opened up and at the same time it has this like rubber you know thingies uh, which keeps it really um tight and close um to the floor okay so um, what I'm going to do is I'm just going to open this up for you. As you can see, it opens up really quickly and really fast and really easy. Right? And, um, you know, basically, um, my, my son will be able to sit just like right here. Um, and there he goes. <laughs> yes. Uh, come. Do you want to sit down, Keith? Do you want to sit down and show everyone how you like your chair? So yeah, when he sits, sit, when he sits down, it's not gonna see, it's not gonna, I'm just gonna move the camera, it's not gonna topple at all because, um, you know, it's extremely stable. Keith, how do you lean back? Lean back and show everyone. Yeah, see, he's leaning back and it's really stable. It's not gonna topple. Um, you know, and um, there are like these seat belt straps as well, which can keep him, um, you know, um, onto can keep him onto the chair as well um, and at the same time <laughs> there are straps at the back come Keith come Mom, come let mommy show show them the rest come come on come Keith come on. so at the back of the chair there are these straps um, as well as the bottom of the chair um, see there are these straps which you can strap it to any chair at all um, and then it becomes, a, you know, a booster chair for you or like a high chair. Don't, don't climb, Keith, please. Okay? It becomes like a booster chair or a high chair. Um, I don't have the table with me right now here, but there is an attached table um, that comes right here, which is removable so that it sits, you know, um, just right here. Um, and my son can have his meal, um, you know, at the table just, you know, uh, right here. Um, and he can do, you know, stuff like his um, drawing. He can do drawing. He can um, just play um, at the table right here. Um, it's just attached um, to the seat. Yeah, so um, that's really mu uh, pretty much why I actually love um, this chair so much. Um, the table can be folded down flat as well. And I can actually bring this, um, you know, chair um, to my mom's house uh, when I fold it up. Um, and I actually put it into like... Um, you know, I put it into um, a bag. Um, it's so portable because I can actually bring this over to my mom's um, place as well. Um, so yeah, um, I think this is a, an amazing, you know, baby chair that I discovered. Um, I don't carry this unfortunately um, on my carousel store, um, but um, this is just you know a hack. Um, or a discovery that I had that I wanted to share with a lot of you uh, new mothers out there. Okay, I think this is called, uh, just to repeat again, this is called Agard. And it really works um, amazingly, you know, um, if you have like a small place um, or if you're looking for a booster chair that can act, you know, as well as um, can, can act, you know, like a baby chair as well that's extremely stable, uh, which you can use, I think even... I don't know till the age of like four because my son still fits into the chair and you know still has plenty of space um, to grow yeah so thanks for watching um, if you do enjoy videos like this um, please follow me you know and give my video a thumbs up as well um, and do shop you know um, with me for mummy items I do carry a range of uh, jujube items on my carousel store uh, it's also called Super like Super Mum Legacy, um, and I only ship uh, within Singapore. Um, if you are in Singapore, thank you. Bye bye.